Hi, friends and golfers. I want to show you real quick uh, a new student I had the other day I was working with, and um, just to hopefully point some things out to help you out um, out there. So, if you notice what happens here, and you know, <laughs> when you have one lesson, you can't you can't fix everything. So, what I like to work on is I try to find out what can get him going on the path that we want to um, eventually lead to. Um, so I had to get him, so here's the swing, standing up a ton, and then look at this club come down, all arms, you know, and then he looks like he's at a dress right here, and then just chicken wings it like that, boom. Okay, so if you look at where he is, you know, if we just check this point here, so where he gets to here, and... You know, do we still have some of the issues going on uh, from before? Yeah, we do. But where you started working on them and, you know, getting him to quit um, raising up his body so much um, is going to be the big change. And we've done, you know, TPIs been so helpful because I've been able to identify issues with his body of why he is doing things. Um, so super helpful so you look at him here still stands up you know he's not getting the shoulder turn we need but then you, at least you see his hand path is different here so i really like to look at hand path i think it's one of the huge differences between uh, amateurs and pros uh, is hand path and if you look at him here let's go to the top here so this is right in transition basically here and if i draw a line from here to the ball Look at his hands. <laughs> right to the ball. To me, that tells me your subconscious says, hit that golf ball, right? There's not a pro that does that. Every pro would be underneath that line. So now let's see here what he's doing now. He still has hands under it now. And then look where he gets the club to. I'm going to do that line so you see it. Look how he's in a better position here. Okay. Would I like to have more rotate underneath? Yes, and that's what we're starting to work on. But he doesn't have the agility. He needs to, um, I'd say, mobility right now that he needs to. But he's starting to open before, which is so different with those hips right there. And so even getting through like that is a good good change from when the weight all left. So he was hitting draws with it and was happy. So we'll attack one thing at a time and get him better uh, during this process so he can reach his goals. He's a guy who can, you know, got great hands cuz he can shoot a 42 but also can shoot a 58 on 9 and put those two together. So we need to make some changes so his body is more active. Thanks for watching Eric Schulberg, EJS Golf.